back and uh, we can see the girls getting ready for that 100 metre hurdles final. And uh, we're going to bring you a start list, Mossy. Here it is, the starting lineup for the women's 100 metre hurdles. Here we have Clay, Costa, Pearson, Jenica, Bean, Tadiao, Ito, and Morrison. Now, the ones to watch here undoubtedly will be Sally Pearson. Jenica, well, she's run a personal best this morning, has gone sub 13 for the first time. Bean won't be too far away from the minor medals, and either will Tadio. So that, that's probably one of the interesting battles is between Brianna Bean and. Abby Taddeo, uh, but undoubtedly the favourite will be none other than your Olympic champion. She's won championships at Worlds, indoors, everything. Commonwealth champion. She holds the records of Olympics. She hasn't got the world record, but I reckon it's not too far away. And she has the Commonwealth, Oceania and Australian records to boot. Sally Pearson, Michelle Jenica to Brianna Bean and Abby Taddeo fighting it out there. And she's just giving a wave to the crowd. Gave everyone a little bit of a scare in the lead up last night with a bit of a hamstring tightness or twinge. There's Shelly Jenica, just a nice little wave to the crowd. She'll do her little dance. There she is. You ever thought of having a dance like that, Bee? Uh, no, I never tried that dance. So I don't think I've got the hips for it. I've got the style. I'm not, yeah, I can't pull that off. Distance runners can't pull that off. <laughs> <laughs> Chelsea Yench on the runway and gets a decent jump out in the women's long jump. We'll bring you that result shortly as we're fixated on the women's 100 metre hurdles final. This and the men's race promises to be a cracker. And uh, you can see the field focusing in. And they're going into their blocks. And we're in the starters' hands for the final. The Australian Championships, the 100 metre hurdles, wants to watch Pearson in four and Jenica in lane five. Away in this 100 metre hurdles final. Pearson away well, so is Jenicky. It's Pearson and Jenicky going side by side. She's really pushing Pearson, but now Pearson starts to run away with it. And Sally Pearson will be our national champion. Clock Whoa. doesn't stop. I Whoa. think that was fast. Well, I think that was very fast. A great run from Shelly Jenicky, really pushing Sally Pearson. We'll wait for that official time very shortly. The clock has ticked over a bit too much, but we'll get that official result for you. And uh, that looked quick and sharp. Even and bigger than that, boys. Chelsea Yench has gone 674. Hey. Long jump. That's a world qualifier. Legal. Legal. And now puts her in the lead in front of a home crowd here at the Queensland Sport and Athletic Centre. She is on fire. Chelsea Yench, take a bow. That is massive. Great jumping from Yench. I might run. 1255. Legal Taylor for Sally. Look at her. She's off her face. She's stoked. 12.55. 12.55. That is superb from Sally Pierce. 12.82 She's for Jenicky. 12.82 for Jenica. Jenica, 12. Jeez, unbelievable stoked. stuff. Look at and this. look at this. Sally Pearson coming yes. over and embracing her. How good is that? She knows that Michelle Jenica is the future of the sport, but at the moment, Sally Pearson. Look at this. Oh, Sally, here we go. Her. How nice is that? Oh, somebody oh. stop me. Oh. <laughs> what the crowd wants to see. It's what we want to see. Well, this progression, let's not forget the season was nowhere near sub-13. She's gone twice. Twice sub-13 now. This is amazing stuff by Michelle Jenica. And she is over the moon. Absolutely over the moon.